So, hey, it's been a while since I've actually had to sit down and update on what my life has actually become. <laughs> um, yeah, well, you know, I've never really thought about this, but uh, I was literally trying to sleep and I woke up. Um, it's like 3 a.m. in the morning, so. Um, yeah, I don't know if, you know, I'm a very well-known rapper or not inside my own hometown, but, um, I continuously grow from Porter Quillum's, you know, uh, rap collective, and I'm, what I know anyway, from stat-wise and online-wise, that I'm the biggest rapper out of Porter Quillum, and it's not going down, I'm staying in that position, you know, the King of Poe Compton position has been filled by me, so, before it was like, you know, I'm, made I don't give a fuck's productions and I was trying to get on the same lane as uh <laughs> Mercules and um uh, guys like Easy Mac but I realize now that I'm not there yet and it takes time, you know, it takes effort and it takes a lot of uh dedication. <clears throat> Shout out to those guys though obviously because <laughs> Mercules is awesome. I, I fuck with his music and if he you know eventually talks to me that'd be dope. Um, so yeah, I'm recognized by a few artists, I know that, um, I've gotten over, well, we've hit about 7,000 views, basically, on this channel, by itself, almost, um, it's 6,630, which is pretty close to 7,000, right, um, I'm doing an interview tomorrow, which would be Friday, and it's gonna be, uh, Halloween soon, um, yeah, let me know what you guys are doing for Halloween. That'd be awesome. Um, leave a like and share to this video, you know. Um, and, yeah, you know, I, I'm surprised with what I've done over the years. Um, so I started when I was 16. And now I'm almost 24. And, you know, um, my sound is different. It's very different. Um, I've taken so much time and effort into just crafting my sound, I guess, that, um, you know, my sound doesn't sound like anybody else's, so, yeah, um, so, the way that I Don't Give a Fucks Productions is going is kind of slanted right now, um, I've been going through a lot, um, over the years, uh, I broke up with my ex, obviously, that's evident in my music, uh, and we have a kid together, so I've been working my ass off trying to pay backwards and then continuously move forwards with my music. So life is very struggling. Um, I also had a few mental breakdowns. Um, I was on prescription medication numerous times, and now I'm off of it completely. <laughs> and I'm smoking weed because it's legal now in Canada, um, and I, you know, just live my life, basically, uh, so yeah, I'm trying to find a new way to, I guess, spread myself more out there for music, um, so that I can eventually, you know, start making a better income off of it, I've made about $10 off music, so it's nothing terrible, but that's after years of, you know, doing it, and, you know, it's starting to feel like it's not paying off, so, um, I'm in a place where I'm not too sure about what I want to do with my life. You know, I'm kind of going up and down. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know how I'm doing, you know, mentally and how my life's been changing so much. Uh, it's been a lot since, you know, I graduated high school. So, <laughs> um, yeah, I'm going as Joel for Halloween this year from The Last of Us. <laughs> I'll take a picture of that for sure and uh, post it on Instagram later. So, yeah. And if you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram. Um, You can follow me at MC underscore Scorpinox. So, yeah. Um, Sad Boy Denzel also left. I don't give a fuck's productions. Um, yeah. A lot of things have changed. So, I'm only looking to go up. That's the one thing you guys gotta know. So I'm not suicidal, I'm not hugely depressed about anything other than, I don't know, 
my love life. <laughs> um, shout out to Montana, by the way. <laughs> she probably hates me anyway, but um, that's my ex girlfriend. Uh, so yeah, you know, I just I want things to go better for myself and for you guys too. You know, fans, I actually care about you quite a lot. Um, I don't know when I'm going to upload this exactly, but I'll upload it soon, probably tonight. It's hard to say, but anyway, yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know how I'm doing and keep you updated on that, you know, because, uh, obviously you care about me, so, <laughs> all right, and, uh, Nothing More to Hide 2 is definitely coming out on February 9th, just letting y'all know now, which is my mom's birthday, shout out to my mom's, um, and, yeah, I've been releasing albums for years, and I've conquered a lot of hate, so, yeah, and, uh, I hope y'all have a good night.